On Monday, April 8th, a total eclipse will be visible across portions of North America. To celebrate, Sonic is releasing a limited-time Blackout Slush float, consisting of Blackout Slush, Vanilla Soft Serve, and Galaxy Sprinkles. But is this a dessert that's out of this world, or something as dim as the total eclipse itself? Let's find out. But first, let's take off these Eclipse protection glasses that is handed by a very unenthusiastic Sonic employee, mainly because I can't see anything through it, and find out if this is something that's worth getting. Now you might be asking, what does a Blackout Slush taste like? And after saying, oh, I'm so embarrassed for you, I'd let you know that Sonic describes it as a sweet cotton candy and dragon fruit flavor. Now that doesn't sound bad on paper, but let's see how it tastes in execution. Now I haven't really had dragon fruit before, but I'm not opposed to it, and I do have a bit of a sweet tooth, so like cotton candy. So overall, it sounds pretty good, but let's do a first time ever taste of the Blackout Slush. Aerate it. Warm it up. Okay, that is pretty good. Now it is very sweet, so if you often find desserts to be too sweet for you, I think this is going to be added to the list. But I think it is pretty good and a bit distinct. Now I don't really know what dragon fruit tastes like, but overall it kind of tastes like a milder grape flavor, and it's pretty good. Now let's go ahead and try it with the ice cream. Okay, this scoop, this spoon is just straight up ice cream, no slush. Okay, there we go. That's a little more balanced. Yeah, it's pretty good. Now let's see how it is when you mix it all together. The slush, the ice cream, and the sprinkles. But I will say, some of the star sprinkles are a little tough, and so I feel like mixing it and then being able to eat it and then have to chew the sprinkles themselves, I think it's going to be something that I'm not really going to be a fan of. But I feel like as far as sprinkles go, they're definitely decent. Alright, after mixing it together, it became this grayish, slightly purple paste, but, you know, I'm more interested in taste than looks, so let's see how it does. Yeah, that's pretty good. Mine seems to be like 60% ice cream, and it's kind of hard to mix the slush at the very bottom of the cup, but this is really good. The Blackout Slush Float only comes in one size and seems to be priced at $3.99 nationwide, but I think for $4, this is a pretty fair amount of slush and ice cream, so I think it's pretty decently priced overall. Now, I'm very budget-focused, so paying $4 for a dessert still seems kind of high, but it'll be available starting today, March 25th through May 8th, and so I can still see myself getting it two or three more times before it goes away for good. I really enjoyed it, and I also enjoyed their previous Strawberry Shortcake Snowball Slush Float, so glad to have something like that again. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you'd like to stay tuned for any future videos I make, feel free to subscribe or leave a comment. By the way, thanks for watching. I truly appreciate it. I'll see you guys next time.